the rectangle for ABCD, um, that BC, CF, FD, and AD are congruent. So BC equals CF, and which equals FD, and all three of those will equal AD. Okay, what are these little markings right here on the diagram tell you? From B to C, okay, BC equals CF, they're equal. If we know that there is a mark here, one mark like that, we call it one little tick mark, and then I have one tick mark here, one tick mark here, and one tick mark here. Uh, and, and from here, from D to F, it's also given us some information here. Length of FC, BC, and AD. What would be the lengths there? Four. But you go ahead and write that in here. So four from F to C, from B to C is four question is what is the probability that a point chosen at random lies in the shaded region okay, so we know that this side here has to be multiplied to this side four times eight how do i get eight four plus four all right so the entire length from d to c is eight okay that's my rectangle that's the area of the rectangle do you remember the formula for triangle base times height divided by two so here's my height from here to here in blue is four that entire length comes from the side of the rectangle so that's four base times height divided by two so i would put four times four times point five okay that'll take care of it had these shaded area then everything else inside this triangle but the triangle everything inside the rectangle and we were to try to figure out what the probability was to land in those areas then you'd have to take the rectangle subtract the triangle 